this week on Health Watch, beating the winter blues starting tomorrow morning. It's going to feel well, really like winter. At 2 a.m., we set the clocks back and fall back to standard time. A depressing prospect for a lot of people. Research even suggests that winter's shorter days can send our moods into a nosedive. Well, you can fight back with the right foods, supplements, and exercise. And nutritionist Tanya Zuckerbrot has the seven secrets to boosting your mood and immunity. Great to have you with us, Tanya. Thank you. And I need these tips. <laughs> so let's start out with lifting your spirits yes. with omega-3s and well, what we have here. You know, there is some truth to the winter blues, but it's actually a clinical disorder that affects 25 million Americans. And it actually affects women four times more. So these winter blues lead you to, lead, to be less social, to be more irritable. So we of foods that can help to boost your spirits as well as help fight immunity, beginning, as you said, with these omega-3s. Now, a recent study by the National Institute of Health followed 1,400 female subjects, and they found that those women who did not eat omega-3 fatty acid-rich foods reported being two times as depressed as those who had 10 ounces of seafood, which is known to be high in omega-3. So here we have some examples of omega-3 foods, obviously salmon, mm -hmm. but if you don't like fish, walnuts and flax seeds are also great sources of omega-3. Serotonin is also something we yes. want to produce in our body Correct. to make us feel a little better, to right. uplift our spirits. What are these foods that we can take right. to lift our serotonin? Well, serotonin is not naturally found in foods, but tryptophan, which is an amino acid found in foods, is a precursor to serotonin. So here we have foods rich in serotonin, which include cottage cheese, turkey, bananas. So a great breakfast would be take some cottage cheese, add some fiber-rich cereal, put some bananas in there. And stock up on Thanksgiving, right? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so vitamin D comes from the sun, but you can also get it from mm -hmm. different foods. Yes. And vitamin D has both immunity um, benefits as well as boosting um, your mood. So mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's a, it's it's a, a great dual. balance. It, exactly. Now, the issue with vitamin D, why we seem to get colds more often and feel more depressed in the winter, is that we're getting less sunlight. 10 to 15 minutes of sunlight will actually give you enough vitamin D. And in those winter months, we're not getting enough sunlight. And it's hard to get enough vitamin D from foods. And they actually mm. set new standards. 1,000 IUs of vitamin D is what's recommended, not just for immunity, but also vitamin D has been shown to reduce risk for cardiovascular disease and diabetes. I want to make sure that we juice. definitely get yeah. to the vitamin C, because obviously that's something that's going to boost our immunity. How much do we want to have of these different items on a daily basis? Well, it's recommended that we only get 90 milligrams of vitamin D, but there are some studies that support as much as 10,000. Okay, so I think stock around up. 1,000 milligrams will suit you and help to fight colds, broccoli, orange, and of course red pepper, great sources. And then zinc. Zinc. And zinc and vitamin C actually work well together. Zinc has been shown to boost immunity, and adding vitamin C to zinc rich foods actually helps the absorption of zinc. Zinc is mostly found in animal protein, so we have chicken and steak, but for those vegetarians, you can also get it in beans. Good to know. And lastly, exercise. We don't want to underwrite the importance or, or underdo the importance of getting good exercise in the winter. Exercise helps with mood because it releases endorphins, but a study showed that people who get 40 minutes of exercise per day actually experience fewer colds in the winter. So two benefits right fewer there. Colds. And perhaps it'll get you going One outside. reason to get off the couch. <laughs> outside and more vitamin D absorption. Thank you so You're much, welcome. Tanya Zuckerbrot. We really appreciate it.